Welcome back, everyone, to Ikarana. This music's groovy. All right, let's go. Only to silent. Hey on. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm trying to, I'm trying to do Irish accent. It's been a while. Yeah, it feels weird. It feels so weird. Yeah, I never seen La Zan laugh like that wholeheartedly for quite a while. The princess is really something, huh? Oh, wait, wait, shit, I did the wrong one. The princess is really something, eh? Oh? Uh, maybe it's because she's a girl. Zan has troubles opening up to guys, after all. When was the last time she had a boyfriend, anyway? It doesn't matter, last lad. It doesn't matter, lad. We're still too close to her, no? Oh, so you're saying we lose to Remy despite being able to see Zan every day? I'm not. Like, zoinks! Lady Zan has such a charming smile. Sorry, I didn't mean to butt in or anything. I was just talking to myself. Oh, Sir Alphonse. <clears throat> yes? If I were you, I'd better keep my distance from Zan. I mean, some bad things could happen. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Get turned to the Irish accent. Yeah. Ye. Yeah. Yeah. Top of the morning to ya. <laughs> Name's Jack Septic guy. Uh, no. Yeah, yeah, some very uh, bad things. I'm doing Scotland accent. There we go. Yeah, some very uh, bad things. Oh, shut up and let me do my job, huh? <laughs> Sorry, that's not shaggy. <laughs> uh, awkward. So, we would have decorated this place more if you didn't come so early. Sorry about that. I didn't think that you'd be here after all. Do you have business to attend to later? It can wait. It can wait. It can wait. Hello there. It can wait. That's great. That's great to hear. I'm trying. I keep forgetting. Oh, Zen, I have so many, th many things I want to talk to you about. So many thing, so many things I want to talk to you about. Go ahead. We have plenty of time, don't we? Oh, that's right. I forgot to introduce Al to you. This is Alphonse. He's a royal knight, currently tasked with babysitting me. It's nice. <coughs> no, sorry, Shaggy. It, it, it's nice to meet you, Lady Zan. Likewise. I'm really sorry about the confusion earlier, Sir Alphonse. Ah, uh, it's all right. It was my fault for not explaining myself clearly, after all. I still can't see why a dummy like you could pass the test. Was it, like, really difficult? It was. It, it was! Princess Rami, that was so mean of you. I tried really hard for this position, okay? And wasn't you the one who ordered me to take it because you couldn't stand your current night back then? I know, I know. I was just messing with you. Jeez, don't sulk. I'm going to report to, to back to the capital. You're sneaking out to play. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. What does that mean? Well, I said I was supposed to visit you in a week, right? <laughs> that was partially true. I was too excited and couldn't wait, so I sneaked out with Alphonse to come here earlier. Yes, and we'll have to be back by tomorrow. I know, Al, you don't have to remind me. After all, I'll return here for my official visit next week. Isn't sneaking out like this bad, though? Yeah. Nah. Yeah. What if people think you're running away with your knight? Mm. Nah, it's okay. No one really cares that much about me, to be honest. Besides, people still think I'm sulking inside my room at the castle. Really? How? I had a maid dressing up as me. You can do that? Yes, she can do that. In fact, it's her job. 
I see. Oh, I see that you've gotten used to being a princess. I wonder what kind of queen you'll become. I guess I still be myself. What am I doing French? It make more sense. I guess I'll still be myself. I mean, I know crap about running a country. What did you expect from a 17 year old? 17 years old girl anyway. 17 years old girl. Alright, that is grammatically correct, I believe. I'm just like their puppet. I'll do whatever they tell me to do. And I'm happy with that. Oh, I'm sure it wouldn't be that easy, Remy. Yes, it's that. That's where you and Nan come in. What? Me? Well, yeah, I hope, but mostly Zan. Right, Zan? Yeah. What are you talking about? Oh, Zan hasn't told you yet. <clears throat> I guess it'll take a lot of time since it's what Zan and I have been <clears throat> discussing for quite a while. Sum it up. Basically, if I needed your help, would you come to my aid lines? I know that's a difficult question to answer, and I won't force you to answer it. Hmm. It depends on the situation. If I can help you, I will do the best of my ability. That's a wise answer. Sorry for always thinking that you're a kind of dumb. <laughs> Until now, right? What did you say about me? So you don't need- So, you don't need my aid, huh? <clears throat> and mine too! What? It's literally your job to aid me, Al. And where the hell is my cake on? I need your help with that. Oops, I almost forgot. There we go. Ooh, that's a nice cake. You baked it yourself? Yeah, I can cook. His cakes are really great. Yeah, his cakes. You should open. <laughs> you should open a bakery. I'll give you the royal stamp of approval. Sorry, but I'm kind of busy. Kind of busy with my full-time mechanic job right now. Let me try a bite. Ooh, it's so good. This cooking is great too. You should have been a girl instead. You want me to punch you? You fucking. You fucking maggot. He's a perfect <laughs> wife material, I see. Hey! I agree. Not not you two. You're making me blush, lass. Oh, that reminds me. I have presents for you. I'll fetch me the suitcase. Wait. Oh, like, yes, your highness! <laughs> At this point, I might as well make the uh, princess r r sh uh, not r <laughs> I was gonna say, my name is Scooby. ruh -ro. What is it? <laughs> He's asking for food. <clears throat> Oi, lass, is it food? Yeah, cho <laughs> Yeah, chocolate! Zen's favorite, freshly brought from the best sweet shop at the capital. And you bought a suitcase full of the stuff? Well, it's Zen we're talking about. You have a point. What? Don't talk like that. I adore chocolate, but not that le uh, to that level. You're gonna get so you're gonna get so fat from all the chocolates, then. <laughs> not that I mind, lass. Uh, yeah, I prefer milk with a little chop. You guys can stop right now. <laughs> <laughs> now why they say like you guys can stop right there? Remy pumped open the chocolate box of chocolate and presents it to Zan. Why does the third person have to be, you know, English, Irish? I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, Zan, choose one. Bam bam. This is groovy music. I, I didn't realize how groovy it was. Hmm. Huh. Eh? Don't look so disappointed. You'll get to eat the whole thing, I promise. I'm just curious to see which one you'll choose first. That's all. Hmm. Do I get to choose? I don't, 
of all the chocolates inside the box. Out of all the chocolates inside the box, there are three pieces that caught Santa's eyes. So, these chocolates don't mean shit. Almond milk chocolate. Looks taste and exactly how it sounds. Simple, but still sweet and delicious. Chocolate with nice, sweet, but unusual color inside. Probably has alcohol inside. Pure white chocolate with elegant shape. It has a pink hue to it. It must be filled with raspberry gauge. Alright, so... This must mean pink hair dude. This must mean all. This must mean the other kid. Let's do the one with the alcohol. Because the Irish lad loves his alcohol. I was right to make him Irish. Okay, fucking alcohol. Ooh, so you like your men wild and flashy, huh? A breathtaking encounter that left a sting in your throat, but it was oh so irres irresistible that you couldn't help but want more. Mm, juicy. What are you even talking about? Oh, does that mean she eats men like she eats... Ooh, eats men like she eats chocolate. Hmm. In a batch. No, you idiots. I'm talking about her tasting guys. Sam Dick's a bad boy type. Seriously? I see. Your taste is so bad, son. Yeah, I'm kind of disappointed. What? Listen, I love chocolates. All of all shapes and flavor equally. I just chose that one because it looks appealing. That's all. It's such a tsundere. What's the... That's the point! You found it appealing! Chocolate is chocolate! It doesn't ha have anything to do... It doesn't have anything to do with my preference in men or whatsoever. Aw, but it's interesting to see your reaction. Oh, yeah. It's so rare to see you floss the design. Jeez. Please stop making fun of me. I'm too old for this. You're not old, Diane. You're just older than us. Ugh. Let's talk about something else, please. Like, do you have any plans for tomorrow? I'm fine with whatever, as long as I can spend some time with you, Sam. That reminds me, isn't there a festival downtown tomorrow? Really? What kind of festival is it? It's a harvest festival, with music and food and alcohol. I can't wait to drink this stuff. The standard stuff. Oh, I heard there'll be a giant marionette parade as well. You know, since we're such puppets. Like, really? That sounds amazing! I can't wait to eat all the food! It's been a while since the last time we attended something fun, isn't it? <sighs> it's not a bit just a while, it's been forever! Ah, it's gonna be so exciting, I can feel it. Isn't it dangerous for you to go to a crowded place like that, though? It'll be fine. I mean, you'll protect me, right? Yes, but I'm still worried. She's not a fucking... Do you see a gun on her? Does she have a blade? Is she a certified trained swordsman? You have a guardsman. Why do you have her to protect you? And her security system does not go outside the castle. Have some logic, you idiot princess. You're gonna die. You're gonna die. Watch it. I called it right now. Yes, I'm. but I'm still worried. Relax, Dan. It's just a festival, and I came here in secret. It'll be okay. Furthermore, I got Al around. And I'm very <laughs> confident in my ability. Uh, I don't know why I changed voice there. Yeah, he looks and acts like a moron, but he's in fact one of our best fighters in the country. Don't be such a worry wart, son. I have to agree with Rami on this. Then you're an idiot. You're all fools. I'll make sure to tighten the security downtown. Oi, let's make some fun memories together. We don't usually get this chance to, after all. All of this sounds like a really bad idea. It is a bad idea. She knows it's a bad idea. She's still gonna go along with it. You're a fool. She's gonna get murdered. It's gonna be your fault. Oh, let's all enjoy the festival tomorrow. Yay. Do you have a place to stay tonight yet? Can I stay at your place? Um, my room is basically my workplace. It won't be very comfortable. Well, I've stayed from far more uncomfortable places. I can handle it. 
Yeah, I know it's safer to stay inside the castle. The security is tighter. Be careful though, you could run into my father. It'd be pretty bad if he saw you wandering around. He's not fond of me, huh? Sigh, my official visit is gonna be such a hassle. Do you need an extra bed, son? I'll carry one to your place. It's alright. My bed is big enough for the two, and I'm, I'm afraid there's not enough room left for another bed in, the cor in my corner. Does that mean I'll be sharing a bed with Zed? You perverted princess. Bad princess. And I just realized her side hairs are sticking out of her thing. I thought those were ribbons at first, but those are her fucking hairs. What kind of design of the hat is that? It's so stupid. I don't like it. <laughs> it's like sleepover party, just like the old time. Like old, the old time. Old times, you mean? Oh, Zen, I'm gonna keep you up all night to chat. You're gonna keep her all up all night, eh? Hey, hey, wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Please do. Wink, wink, with nudge, nudge. Yep. Guess I'll be sleeping on the floor. Outside of the room. <laughs> Guess I'll be sleeping on the floor. Guess I'll be sleeping on the floor. Outside the room. Of, co of, of course. Ah, uh, Zan's quarter cast, quarter quarter castle eagles, quarter castle eagles. All right, I think it's a good place to end this one. If you guys enjoyed this episode, please leave a like down below. If you didn't comment down below, you didn't. If you did comment down below, you did. Hey, let me saw. Make sure to subscribe. Hit that bell notification. Anyways, catch you guys later. Let me save. Uh, save. Peace.